I got to fight for my arms. Yeah, in my mind is a warning. Praying to the one. Welcome back to the vlog, guys. We are in Montreal with Call Spring for Oshiega. Um, this is our room. Sorry if the lighting is kind of off. It's like gloomy outside. So today, well, actually this weekend, we have a whole itinerary they made for us. We got some sunglasses, a hat, some necklaces, some cute products. Then we have the shoes here, and then we have a cute handwritten note. I'm so excited. We're so excited to spend a full weekend with you. Content queen, can't wait to see you slay. Oh, this is so sweet. And then they gave us a bunch of snacks and goodies in this custom water bottle with my name on it. I'm so excited. I'm actually really exhausted though. Oh, I haven't talked to the vlog in like literally a month. If you guys didn't know, I went to Jamaica. I went to LA, Montreal, and now I'm back in Montreal again. Got my period this morning, of course. Just checked in. Apparently, they're going to have a glam team for us. So I need to like hop in the shower, get ready. I'm like literally bleeding buckets. I'm here with my girl, Sophia, and you'll meet some of the other Call Spring members. Let me show you the bathroom real quick. I've been kind of slacking with vlogging, but I'm just blaming my period right now. I'm sorry. Okay, so this is... The, ooh, the lighting is good. Uh, okay, so this is the bathroom. They also gave us some little hair accessories here. Okay, this is actually really cute. I didn't really see the bathroom before, but now I'm like, oh, this might be really cute. So I have to film a get ready with me. So I need to like get ready. <laughs> Um, and then we got a cute little bathtub and a nice shower. So plan is to quickly unpack. I'm also doing a story takeover today. So first thing, I'm gonna take a photo of all the cute stuff that they gave me so I can put it on my story. Just want it to look very full and extra. Four of us on this brand trip. So it's really cute because it's very small and intimate, but I kind of like it so that you can like build a close relationship with the brand. Like I'm about to get on a chair right now because I'm that extra. Okay, now I am getting ready and do my makeup. Oof. Like you probably can't hear me with the vent, but like it gets so low. Anyways, it's my period y'all. It's ruining my life. But that just means tomorrow it should be better. I'm just gonna speed this part up and play music. <laughs> you thought I was feeling you? That nigga a munch. Nigga, either he ate it for lunch. Bitch, I'm a baddie, I get what I want. Like, you thought I was feeling you? That nigga a munch. Nigga, either he ate it for lunch. Bitch, I'm a baddie, I get what I want. Like, bitch, stay in balance, keep it a beam. Don't be mad, I be on the scene. Ask too fat, can't fit in a jean. Use my stitch, but it's not with a steam. I got that ready, I'm keeping it clean. Fucking with niggas that's toting a beam. Saying you love me, but what do you mean? Pretty ass fucking ain't like that I'm mean. Guys, I just finished filming. I freaking did it. I didn't think I was gonna be able to do a reel the same day. I need snacks. It's an outfit. It's will see on Instagram. And I might put my hair up oh. or something. I don't know. Anyways, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Mwah. <laughs> Thank you very much. My pleasure. 
Am I allowed to join you all? I told the world cause you can see it in my eyes Though I was short as in the town I'm praying for the lion's demise To the roof of the coop, let's see the sky They thought I'm sweet and I'm a rapper, let's sky I told my nigga no ticks, the cuts have got to pay the price They stab my nigga, are we taking lives? I'm trying to buy you some Chanel's, what's your size, yeah Told my plug I'll buy the bricks, what's the price, yeah We took the way to the money This is the next sitting on the floor for like 30 minutes and then I realized I should have been talking to the vlog but we're back as you see in the clips we were like all over the place I am done like my body is literally cracking my feet honestly they don't hurt like the shoes were amazing it was just because we walked like everywhere oh, my battery's dying one second okay so we're back so I'm gonna sit down and tell you literally everything I'm trying to think of like what's the most comfortable position right now I don't want to lay on the bed because I am like nasty so I think I'm gonna put you here guys I missed you didn't bring my camera because I didn't know if they were gonna take anything away and they didn't even check like anything so I can definitely bring it tomorrow just need to make sure I have a big enough bag I can put everything in but so far so good so today we basically I got on the plane it was like an hour i was so exhausted i got my period today so i was so moody but now i'm so much better we did the lunch um at the rooftop restaurant which is really nice and then we ate came back to the room i tried to like edit and like i posted and edited the same video on the same day which is crazy because i never do that um got to the festival just did content um and like chilled and it was good vibes it wasn't as crazy as coachella which was nice tomorrow i'm gonna read you our itinerary i couldn't talk to you guys earlier because of my freaking period but here's our itinerary for the weekend which i'm really excited so day two is tomorrow we're going to the cult spring pop-up we're gonna shoot some content for the brand then we're gonna go to the festival and Rema's performing tomorrow and that's like one of my favorite artists so i'm really excited and i'm just gonna have to just go and watch all of his performance um and then day three kendrick lamar's performing so that's gonna be a whole shebang um, and we don't really have anything planned. So it's gonna be pretty chill and then at least Day three we can like sleep in a bit and then I have the flight on Monday at 2 30 so right now I'm gonna go have a shower and I really want to be ooh, I want someone that drink hold on Ow. This drink they got it branded. It's like vitamin water, but it's like call it spring water, which is really cool so cute look at their nutrition facts it's like called spring stuff i know some people that are with some other brands so i was hoping to see some people today but i think it was just too hectic so tomorrow yeah and then maybe i'll actually go out because i feel like it's montreal everyone's out and about it's kind of like coachella you go to events and stuff so so nice just walking in the city with like sophia me and her were just talking i'm like damn it's really nice to like not be home like i love home i love my family I love the people in my life. I love just seeing what life is. Like being alone when I go on these trips is really nice because I get to reflect and like, I just love realizing the person I'm becoming. It's just crazy. Like I'll have conversations with people and sometimes I just speak very like, I don't know, God just speaks through me. 
like at lunch we were talking about like content and just the girls were telling me about different things that they want to do with their content and I was just giving advice but it felt so natural and I was like damn I really want to do this for like a long time and that's like mentoring and you know helping people become their true self gain confidence like i just i could do it all day it just feels surreal like sometimes i don't really take in how far i've come and then i go on things like this and i'm like bro i literally like like it says my name on the sheet like i feel like i worked so hard i never really took it in and now it's like i'm living and it doesn't feel like i feel like my life has starting now so it's just interesting. It's all God though. Like everything in my life is for God. I'm here for a reason and excited that I can take you guys on through my journey. This is so exciting. Realizing that, you know, certain things don't call to me anymore and that's okay. So yeah, it's just like, I feel like a grown woman, like, which as I should feel like, right, I'm 26, right? Like, anyways, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. I'm going to take a good night's sleep. No filming and yeah. Bye! Turn on the show. I'm on the loop. I'm on the ways. Oh, I stay out the way. Got another subtle meal like the good morning it's day two in Montreal. I am exhausted. I cannot believe I am alive right now. Thank you, Jesus. Um, so I just got some Uber Eats because I am starving. I have about two hours to get ready and film a reel again. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm just really tired, but I'm just going to enjoy today, take it day by day. I feel like if I didn't have my period, I wouldn't be as tired. But yeah, let's go see what I got for breakfast. Let's see what we got. waffles so they were gonna put like chocolate and almonds on it but i'm like no it's white chocolate yummy but i don't think i have syrup oh i do here we have oh i thought i asked for scrambled eggs but okay so i got eggs unless something no because it means the same thing so sausages uh bacon hash browns and orange peel and eggs because i need some fuel for today I'm gonna just dive right in. I'm hungry. Mm. Oh, I swear I asked for the eggs to be scrambled. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just realized I ate a whole waffle and I forgot I'm wearing like an extra crop top today. Alright, let's do my makeup in like 10 seconds, bro. Let's get my primer. Okay. Love this. Oh! If you guys watch my Amazon vlog, you know I got these products there and they have changed my skin completely. Oh my gosh. Like, I. My skin has never looked this good before. It's crazy. I have to put this on first. Hyaluronic right, acid. Oops. Whatever, they're all serums, right? <laughs> I don't know how this works. We love wet hair. automatically sprays. Sometimes it's excessive. I'm not going to brush either. Okay, that's enough. Ah. I just wet it, put some mousse in it, and just get to go. I'm a hooper, you do me, I'm a do ya Full time, we gon' see who's the loser, the loser Amen, hallelujah Pullin' through your city, I'm a hooper Okay, we're heading down to the Cult Spring pop-up Here is the outfit 
got these cargos from Fashion Nova. <gasps> my shades. Yeah, my shades. Oh no. <laughs> okay, so today I'm gonna try to vlog the entire shebang. Hi! My god, the pink. Oh yeah, right. Uh -oh. <laughs> How are you? Good. You look so cute. Thank you so okay. much. Okay, hopping right in. <laughs> Here she is! <laughs> oh, I love it! It looks so good! Oh. We are on our way to the Call Spring pop up. Got my girl here, like a little fairy! Hello. Hello! And it's currently what time? 3.05. 3.05. So we got a whole day. We're gonna take you along. Now we're in the heart of downtown. Love it! Like Eden Center vibes. Like yeah, it is. Young and Dug Yay! That's so cute! Oh my god, the shoes! You guys look so cute! Thanks! But it's very dark, guys. Let's be honest with you. Hey guys! Not the same one! Oh, yeah, right? Yeah, that's sick. Hey guys, we just got to the Pallet Spring pop up, and it's so cute! Look at all Oh my god, the shoes are actually really cute, actually. I would love to go to festival. These ones? Yeah. 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 Hello guys, we are done day two and we are suffering, but we are walking back currently. Hopefully no one harasses us, but day two was good. We're definitely, <laughs> we can't go. I was really gonna run in the middle of the road. Yeah, day two was a lot. Um, we're definitely taking an Uber tomorrow. Here we go. I love like not being from a place because they can't judge me. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna <laughs> I think so. It all looks the same. Oh, um, 
Montreal, you're a vibe. Now we have one full day tomorrow. We might go shopping, not really. <laughs> and we might go for breakfast, possibly, so. I will keep you updated. And yeah, I will see you later. Bye. <laughs> and we're back. I am done right now. My legs hurt so bad. Yeah, I am exhausted. We took some really nice content though, but now I'm about to go to my bed. I really want to take a bath, but that's kind of extra, so I might just put on a hot shower. What a night. Honestly, I would love to go out, but it's way too much right now. I really think people come into my room and close the blinds. I came in last night and the blinds were closed and I'm like I don't remember closing the blinds and then I come in today and the blinds are closed so now I'm just like okay they must come in the room and close the blinds it's kind of weird but whatever we made it back oh my gosh I have to pee I haven't peed Ow. okay let me take off my shoes at the front because I'm like nasty oh let me lock the door <laughs> yeah we don't play here Hello, I'm back. I just had a shower. Um, it's not as bright in here because that vent is like so noisy, but YouTube, we just hit 10K subscribers. That's crazy. And it's from YouTube Shorts. Like what? 10K, all of you on my line. Um, no, I'm getting really freaking comfortable and we love it. So yeah, um, today was a lot. Let me do my little skincare routine. But we're gonna drip this on my face. I'm excited for tomorrow. We have Kendrick Lamar. Um, I think somebody else, but I don't really like know. Tomorrow's gonna be like our first chill day. Today we went to the pop up. We're doing a lot of their like social media posting, so it's cool to see how brands actually operate and how they do their posting. So. It's interesting. I feel like this trip is really an eye opener and it lets me see behind like the business side of things, which is good. Even the direction I want to go into, right? So yeah, I'm getting a lot of insight on that. Creating content, I realize how much I freaking love this job and I want to shoot content for people. Like I love doing my own content, but man, shooting for people is like crazy. Like I love it. I'm starting to feel like really at peace, so I really feel like God is just opening doors and I can't wait to just share my journey and everything with you guys, but back to the routine. Like right now I'm creating content for social media, maybe later I'll be creating content for like a brand or people's businesses. Actually, I can't say that I do this forever because only God knows what I'm doing forever, so let me not say that, but I will say I've found what makes me happy, what my passion is, and I could do this for a long time. I never thought I would find that, but God literally brings you in the direction of what you want to do. So that's crazy. I'm excited for my journey and I feel like I'm not comparing myself to people in the past. I have been like when I went to Coachella, I was looking at other influencers and just comparing myself to people in America and I'm like, there's no opportunities in Canada, but that's an excuse. Like I feel like Again, we're making opportunities. And I'm so glad I'm able to connect with Canadian brands now and build my Canadian audience. So it's just very interesting, but like everything is just going how it is. I don't wanna say my life is perfect, but I wanna say that I am finally just being at peace with everything in my life. Whatever God tells me to do, I'm just doing it and I'm not looking back. And I can't believe I'm becoming the person that I always wanted to be. This is crazy. You can truly like find and be whoever you want to be. A lot of opinions I've just let go. A lot of people around me that are not good for me, I let go. I'm just focused on my family, my relationships, my career in the healthiest way possible and taking care of my body besides this weekend because I've been definitely suffering. But this is just crazy. Like God, you are doing something and I really hope I can help and inspire people to continue to follow him, to continue to find your passion, to take every day as it is. I know it's so hard. This took me like, I, like I'm like i going on like 12, 13 years, man. And you never know what God has planned for you. And stop comparing yourself because everybody's journey is different. And I wouldn't be in the position that I am now if I didn't listen to him or wasn't consistent. And if I compare myself to someone else's path, like that's not what I'm supposed to be doing in this life. So 
man life is so crazy but i don't think I, like i've never been happier i've never been happier so anyways back to my skincare i've just been i think i'm done yeah i think i'm done <laughs> um yeah i've just been enjoying the ride enjoying teaching people learning I really feel like this year I'm gonna go and tap into my mentoring. I was at the Rema concert and two girls came up to me and they're like, I saw you from Pinterest. Like I'm in the middle of a city that I don't even live in and it's like people that are coming up to me and saying like, it's just weird how God works. Because there was like moments a couple weeks ago, it was just like, I don't know what I'm doing. And then as soon as I left the house and I went to an event and people came up to me and said like, you know, you're the reason I started, like you're the reason why I'm inspired. And does it feel like unnatural to me? It feels like I'm doing what God put in me and what God God's work is. So it's just crazy. Like it's a feeling that you can't even explain until you actually tap into it. But yeah, anyways, regardless, I'm just happy I can take you guys through the journey. I'm happy I can look back at these memories and these videos and just be like, wow, like you really thought like you're living in such a small, mindset and you had no idea what god has for you i'm done blabbling for today um i'm gonna speak to you guys tomorrow i'm just gonna rest and edit and yeah i love you guys thank you so much for supporting me thank you for 10k subscribers um i'm excited to see where our journey goes together and i'm excited to bring you along the journey promise i won't give up on you i love you so much Bye. <laughs> Montreal day three I am done I'm actually doing a bath right now let's go take a look because I need to make sure it's not overflowing and it's not too hot just even there was like kids and I'm like what are these children doing kids. <laughs> yeah apparently kids can go in the, the festival is not yeah like what <laughs> like these parents have money so <laughs> I was like, what is going on? So, Afro Nation? Yes. Did you ever go? No, but I would love to. I would to love go. to. Because yeah. I feel like these festivals, like, I just enjoy Afrobeat. Yeah. Like, that is just like vibes. Good Air vibes. Yeah. yeah. What was doing before? Oh my God. So, I was working retail. Um, During COVID was when it actually started to take off. That's when, like, TikTok, because everybody yes. was at home. Yeah, exactly. So, it's a little bit easier. Like, you can still make content now. It's just. You just have to kind of push yourself a bit more. Exactly. Yeah. I used to be very, very shy. Mm. And then I just started putting myself into like rooms where I had to talk to people. So if oh, it was you like, forced yourself yeah, talking. Yeah, because some people think like, oh my God, if I have like a million followers, I'm going to get all the stuff. But like, it's yes. not even about the followers. It's about like the connection you exactly. have with people. People think, oh my God, I'm so big. Like, relax. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, take it day by day, honey. So, but it's fun. Like, I wouldn't be... I wouldn't want to do anything else, okay. but you just have to navigate <laughs> what to do. Mentor people, oh. and like with their businesses and stuff, and like find ways for them to grow. So, and just find like the confidence in themselves. I feel like a lot of creators are like kind of scared or shy to put themselves out there. So, yeah, exactly <laughs> right. And I meet so many people, and I'm like, oh my god, I was, I was literally you. <laughs> right about that. Yeah, you yeah. have to go. You have to believe like you can do anything exactly yeah and you can Cause even for me like this type of life like was always a dream right oh. and it's like now you can do it girl That's so true yeah i just finished the hair i love it it's like out of my comfort zone but like not really because it's very like cutesy and i feel like i've done this style like before in the past but it's so cute i'm going the lighting so you can see oh my gosh Okay, so right now I'm gonna go to the mall and get some shoes from Cult Spring because the other ones I brought were like too high. So this is gonna be my fit. It's so hot outside, but like I really wanna get a photo in this jacket. And I'm wearing um, this Fashion Nova bra top and then biker shorts. And then I think I'm gonna just be iconic and wear boots, even though I should probably rest my feet, but like the boots are just a vibe. So. Yeah, I'm really feeling this style. It's like different, but I really like it. So waiting for Sophia to finish her makeup. Then we're going to go and I will see you guys at the mall. My car for anything. No, it's okay. If anything, I have my um, car. It's very good. <laughs> we didn't really spend that much, honestly. Yeah. Like, which is pretty good. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> 
because we even still have that whole visa thing and the Ubers we didn't even like use, but today we should definitely yeah. Uber. Yeah, yeah, we Uber there. And <laughs> yeah, we might as well. And we can, oh, we can even do car photos with the flash. Yeah. Yes. Like on our way. Oh yeah. my God, that's so good. I've yeah, been yeah. Those. I forgot. Those are on my Pinterest Yep, here. perfect. Add to list. You're amazing. I love this. <laughs> Oh. And like another thing, yeah. Wait, so that might be better so I have more, more to content. Talk about. Okay. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. Oh yeah, that's uh, okay. French. Oh no. Francais, okay. Uh, Francais. <laughs> Wait, there's a cute. Oops. Call. Oh my. <laughs> Yo, honestly, I'm retiring. Call. Oh, is it in French? Or shoes accessories? Yes. Beauty. Bijou. I think bijou is jewelry. Oh. oh! Oh, perfect. Oh, it's not. Boutique. Call it, call it spring. Oh. Boutique spring. Okay. What does this mean? I don't even. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh what? my gosh. Sortie elevator. Sortie's exit. Yeah. Sortie escalator. Oh, wait. Does it say. What's this? News. I'm getting the behind the scenes. <laughs>
eating. Oh, I just love a clear camera. <laughs> Maybe like right there. Oh, I can put it on the ledge too. Okay, I'll put it. Uh, I'll put it right here. Oh my god, in the ledge would be amazing. For us. Amazing. <laughs> Honestly, the night vibes are got some of it. Yeah, I was gonna say. Definitely. Look at this view. Giving Perry. Okay. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Every single time. <laughs> yeah, I'm a mess. <laughs> Good. Uh, I think here is good. Is okay. Mind if I use the flashlight to Oh, oh shit! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like perfect. So nice. Okay, Are you guys like content creators? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh my god. So good. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. No problem. Thank you. No, that photo looked amazing. Nothing. I didn't know. That. It looked so freaking good. Do you need help? No, it's okay. Thank you so much. You guys are gorgeous. Oh my god. Yay. You got another key, right? Yeah, yeah. Yes. I do not want to take off this hair. It's so cute. I am done right now. Like, first of all, let me take off all my clothes and start eating my damn tacos. I'm in, like, so much pain. Let me sit in my little corner. Oh, such a good day long day i'm like so tired but my hair was such a vibe oh my gosh she really got these in like tight today was like a nice little ending we went to the mall and we were able to get some call it spring shoes because i need to change those platforms that i had take this out first The release is crazy. We came back, I filmed the Get Ready With Me. We went to the concert a little bit late. Um, I saw so many people that I like love. Who did we see? Kendrick Lamar, uh, which is really good. In the, and we went in the VIP section. It was like nice, like we could get a good view. All spring team, amazing. This experience I remember for the rest of my life. Like it was really fun. And it was really fun doing like social media stuff. But yeah, I'm like really debating if I should have a bath. It's like, oh my gosh, what time is it? 147. I have to check in for my flight and pack. And like, I don't know. I should probably take care of my body. So I should probably eat, have some of that liquid IV, shower, and then just focus on the content tomorrow. Like, super fun experience. Can't believe I like did it. My camera's dying. Anyways, okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. It is currently almost 11 and I need to check out ASAP but I wanted to sit you guys down and talk to you a little bit um, I'm just kind of getting ready for the airport this is my airport bit oh my god you can't even see anything I'm so extra right now look at these cute pants I got these from Amazon and they're so tight but they look so good um, yeah, so right now I packed. I actually woke up an hour ago. I took a bath and I cleaned and not me cleaning the hotel like I clean it. Yeah, I cleaned and I packed and I fit everything in my luggage um, besides my stand. And I actually have like 10 of these at home. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to leave it. And I also have hangers. Um, could not fit them. I mean, like, I probably could if I really tried, but I'm like, I don't want to struggle, bro. Like, it's not that serious, and I have a lot of junk at home, so you know what? It's fine. Here's my little babies. Also got these from Amazon. Um, yeah. Oh, I should probably call the hotel so they can take my bags. It's, like, literally almost 11 right now. I just wanted to know if someone could take my bags. Um, I'm checking out today. 226. 
Oh my god, I'll show you my reel. I still need to edit it, kinda. That's your girl. If she tell, that's a good referral. Heebie jeebie talk crazy to me, but Kendrick know I like regular girls. Let me put on my sweater and my shoes. Damn, now I get to go home. I love home, but you know what? I'm really enjoying traveling by myself, especially for work, because I feel like I'm just learning so much about myself. And now I don't have like major anxiety because I remember the first trip I was like suffering. Like I don't like to, um, I'm like sleeping. I mean, I sleep at home, right? But my family's there, so I don't feel as scared. But when I come to new places and cities, sleeping alone, like, kind of scares me. But I'm learning to, like, give that to God. Okay, so I have all this. Oh, my God, deodorant. Okay, perfect. And then I'll head down there shortly. Thank you. I meet Sophia in the lobby. She's almost done packing, so... I'm just gonna like take like 10 minutes just to relax here. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye! City area. Yeah. So it really was just old court. Yeah. It was so pretty though. Oh, down there is. Yeah. No